Hey guys, happy Wednesday. Oh wait, I can't eat that. 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 Are these things that you say to yourself all the time? I'm sorry, I'm on a diet. I can't eat your chips and your cheese and your candy because well, I'm on a diet and it's just not there for me. Do you struggle with that? Are these things that you do every single day? Well, honey, we definitely need to stop that. Okay, we need to put an end to the I can't eat that syndrome, okay? Because I wanna tell you something, you can eat it. You certainly can. But it's all up here in between these two sides of your head in your mind. You literally have to stop the diet. You have to stop the fad. You have to believe that there is a better way to do this. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm a mom, so sometimes I'm like, oh my God, you cannot eat that. Oh my God, you cannot eat that. Oh my God, you cannot eat that. And I get it, because you can't have your kid eating sweets every day, all day long. But do you know research actually shows that if you allow your kid to eat whatever the heck they wanna eat, eventually they're gonna get bored of it and choose not to eat it anymore. That's what's funny, is we put so many restrictions on our kids and on ourselves that we keep telling ourselves, oh hey, I can't eat that. And then the moment we allow ourselves to, it's like binge, 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 splurge, 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 splurge. Well, I'm here to tell you I'm Leslie Urbis. I'm a registered dietitian and a personal trainer, and my goal is to help you get on a diet where you stop saying, oh girl, wait a minute, I can't eat that. Instead, you say, give me all the chips and cheese. You wanna know why? Because I've learned how to do it right. I've learned how to do it for me, and I've learned, with the help of my friend Leslie, how to get it all right. Now, the struggle is, is that I too struggle with that. Like I sometimes say, oh, I'm sorry, I can't have the chips and cheese. Oh, I can't have that, or I shouldn't have that. That process is we need to make some peace with food. I personally have come up with a way that works for me that I wanna share with you and help you to find your own personal way to be able to say, you know what? It's not that I can't eat that, it's that I don't really need that right now. I don't really want that right now. That doesn't make me feel better. And come up with the reality of how you can make this work for you in a healthy way. So, without further ado, I want to personally invite you again to my personal journey as well as my personal nutrition and fitness guided plan for you. This is not something where I'm gonna give you plan A, B, C, or D that you're just gonna automatically get. It's going to be something where I work with you to get you to the action in which you want. Okay, we're gonna pick the right program for you, get you on the right workout regimen, and we're gonna make a meal plan and a meal situation where you can stop saying, oh wait, I can't eat that. Are you in?